Hello, sports fan. This is Stephen here with Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the Browns pulled the trigger. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure that you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates and all the breakdowns. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Looking at this week, we've seen a trade of Jerry Judy from the Browns. I mean, from the Broncos going to the Browns, excuse me. Um, essentially a bargain deal sale. When you look at the likes of Amari Cooper, when you look at the likes of David Njoku, and you look at the likes of Deshaun Watson and Nick Chubb, this offense is now pouring into something bigger. This offense is becoming something better. And you look at it like this, Jerry Judy was drafted with the number 15 overall pick to the Denver Broncos. He hasn't yet quite panned out. But when you're looking at what he potentially could be with Amari Cooper and that offense, he could be a number two solid receiver and he's looking to get paid. So you got to think this is going to be on the second half, the last year of his rookie deal. He wants to get paid somewhere. So this is going to be a chance for him to get a fresh start and, and for him to really fit into his, his mold other than just a guy that Steve Smith called him. When you think of how dominant this offense can be, and you think about how great this offense could be, it's mind-blowing. The, the, the ability to take the top off the offense, you got Amari Cooper, the route runner, over on the other side. Najoku controlling the middle linebacker position in the middle. This bodes for an excellent trade. When you look at the Denver Broncos, they're selling off all their assets because they don't have any money because you're having to get under the salary cap to fit because of Russell Wilson's salary. This is tough because if, if, if Deshaun Watson come back and he's Deshaun Watson of old, this could be a firing offense that essentially makes the playoffs and makes the Super Bowl. Because you have a lot of traction, because you have a lot of distractions and things like that, they need to get an offseason where everybody's healthy. They need to get an offseason where every single person inside the locker room understands the offense. This feels like the time for Jerry Judy to be on the Browns. When you look at Deshaun Watson, he's supposed to be throwing in a couple of weeks. When you look at Nick Chubb, he possibly could be back in a couple of weeks. Not playing fully, but he could be essentially on the team, uh, uh, around team activities, doing things like that. And you got to think, the defense for the Browns is already great. This is going to elevate them to possibly second behind the Ravens in the AFC North. You know that right now that Russell Wilson plays for the Steelers, they're going to have to do a lot with this. So when it comes down to this, you never know what can happen. But with that being said, this is a, a great trade for this team. I feel like when it's all said and done, you're going to see this pan out. And I think that this is going to bode well if people can remain healthy on the Browns. So everything from Deshaun Watson, Amari Cooper, David Njoku, um, uh, uh, um, Nick Chubb, and Jerry Judy, this is potentially an explosive offense. You already saw what they did with, with essentially a 38-year-old quarterback, 40-year-old quarterback. So with, with Flacco at the helm, they did what they did, and they still made the playoffs. So who's to say that they can't? So I'm picking them to do wonders in this one. I think that this offseason is going to be great. Stefanski, head coach Stefanski, is going to have to work his magic, but he can get the job done with this. I feel like when it's all said and done, it's going to be special, and it's going to be something that they can do. So I'm picking this as a great trade. I think Jerry Judy has some growing to do, some maturing to do. Um, you know, it's, it's tough. So... But definitely check out Sports Trace Plus for all the breakdowns and other updates. We'll see you on the next video. And tell me what you guys feel. What do you feel about the trade? What do you feel about the Browns? What do you feel about the Broncos? Get in the comment section below, okay? All right.